Uh, my name is Michael Carpenter. In high school, we took shop, ag classes, you build smaller things, everything. Uh, I hunt, so you know, you build deer stands, things like that. Uh, you build things around the house that you need, whether it's a porch or uh, awning, things like that. You just you get raised, you know, building things, making things, and it just kind of sticks with you. And I, just, I guess the enjoyment of just making something new. Whether um, whether it's with your hands or with a computer, I, I just enjoy making things. So, because I built my computer, uh, my dad and I build things at home. Just, I enjoy building things. So whether it's with my hands or on a computer, that's, that's kind of the basis of it. I just enjoy creating something. It was my last semester of college, a year and eight months or so ago. Uh, I came up here for an interview. It went okay, they gave me a shot. and. I'm still here, so I haven't screwed up too bad. But when somebody has an idea, it can be done. The uh, it's just the fact of figuring out how to do it because sometimes you can figure it out, or you might have something that's kind of close, and you can just tweak it a little bit. And then uh, sometimes you're starting from scratch, and you have no idea where to go, and so you just have to build up from there. And that's the that's the difficult part is when somebody wants something, it's just like it's possible. I don't know how in the world I'm going to do it, but it's possible. And then you have to go up there and uh, I guess Google, Google's your best friend at that point because you at least you try and figure out where to uh, where to find your basics on what you're trying to get and then work your way up from there because I mean we all have we all have our expertise and things and uh, things that we do better at like uh, you know I'm, I'm okay with Photoshop but occasionally I can't get things to work so it wasn't for Jared or Steve you know I'd, just kind of be out of luck and I'd probably spend a lot longer on things than I'd probably need to um, but yeah it's it's definitely important and we've uh, had some had some issues in the past where our team were kind of lack so it's uh, kind of helped reinforce the importance of uh, you know talking to one another and making sure that everybody if you need help don't be afraid to ask for it being here it's just uh, having to transition myself in school we um, it was usually a a group project and when a group project I mean multiple developers working on a thing so when I first started here it was a big transition where a single developer works on a single thing you know and it's all you and uh, and the deadline was still the same so that was uh, that was a, the stressful bit is like ah oh, man I don't have two or three other people to split this up between I have to do all this now this is okay this is how this works so that was a that was a wake up. That definitely was a wake up. I had an internship at one point, and um, the internship was uh, khakis, you know, these business casual uh, shirt tie every day. That's what I expected. Uh, this place is different because I don't have to do that. I don't have to wear khakis and a tucked in shirt and a tie every day. That's uh, that's definitely the different part. I wouldn't say it's a bad part about, or I wouldn't say it's bad. It's just that's the different part about it. I expected if I was working at a business and not on my own that I would have to do the dress and everything like that with my with my key fob and going in and out every day. I, I had to do that at one point during that or during that internship. That's what I had to do. So coming here, the difference is I don't have to do that.